because you for for not doing this ever that's pretty good after those 10 you're gonna do 10 body weight partials i'm gonna show you how to do those okay. just drop the weight You can hold your hand in front. Yeah, there you go. Just keep constant tension on the quads. Let that burn. Let that burn. 10 piece. Come on, let's go. Push it. Push it. Let's go. It's pumping blood in there. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Give me 10. Yeah. Flare those knees out. Flare those knees out. There you go. Push them out. Push them out. Cap like the narco. Narco. Got dope like Pablo. Pablo. Cut dope like Pablo. Cut dope. Chop trees with the Draco. Draco. On the north, got Diego. Say I still a wiggle. We'll be in rapping key low. Snub nose with potato. No monkey in the jungle fly high like a sauna. Bouncing off and then we're trying to weep an anaconda. Jumping in the water, trying to sleep across the border. Got it. Oh, I said I got my big bad for Ronald. I'll bag it. Bag of money, knew I gotta have it. Savage. Put on till a gentleman in Cali. Atlantic. Nigga turn him in about the cabbage. Uh, Kill his whole family if you run off with the package. I just put it back on the way to Bogota. Pack. Fuck his eyes out. And I'm telling what he saw. Fuck him. I'll watch y'all. I don't know if he'll talk. Watch y'all. Get a chainsaw and I'ma saw our legs off. They know that we're a gang, but they say that we're a ring. Investigating, taking pictures of the whole team. I'm a couple trying to do a sting. Sitting there on a bike, going to the middle of the team. Trapping like the narco. Narco. Got dope like Pablo. Pablo. Cut dope like Pablo. Cut dope. Chop trees with the Draco. Draco. On the north, got Diego. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. If this is your first time ever clicking on this channel, welcome. I am here to share all things about my bikini prep journey with you guys, but also all things fitness, lifestyle, um, just kind of my journey through this fitness thing that I'm on, trying to get better every single day and just improving, working hard, staying consistent and staying dedicated to those goals so welcome to the channel if you're new if you are returning thank you so much for clicking on this video i'm so glad to have you here today is saturday so it is saturday it's the weekend of fourth of july fourth of july is on monday but for me that doesn't necessarily mean anything because i probably will be working next week but it's saturday and it is my weekend off technically so i'm gonna bring you guys along for the weekend just a little bit of a vlog a couple of clips of what we've been up to um and i'll start by putting in here a clip of the groceries that i bought yesterday for this coming week because i'm gonna be prepping those in this video as well so i'm gonna put that clip right here all right, so just going around, I'm just gonna show you everything I got from Trader Joe's and Target for next week. The first thing I got was this case of blueberry lemonade sparkling water. I'll probably throw some sweetener in there because I imagine it's probably not very sweet. That was from Trader Joe's, obviously. I got this from Target, this glazed lemon loaf tea. It's caffeine free, so I'm gonna be having that before bed probably. I also got a giant thing of sriracha and two of these Frank's Red Hot Buffalo Sauce. And I got a container of Quick Oats because they were a better price than Trader Joe's. Um, and that's all I got at Target besides some organizational stuff and like some cleaning products, which is pretty boring. Uh, from Trader Joe's, I also got a dozen eggs. I got one cucumber, a new mustard because I'm out. A bag of onions one of these rice things if you know you know those are so easy to have on hand for when you don't feel like making rice i got a half and half for my boyfriend's coffee i got this seasoning blend because i've been wanting to try it for a while so it looks pretty good and i also got some oregano i got an eggplant i'm gonna make some roasted eggplant a bag of arugula I got four of these matcha green tea unsweetened drinks. They're zero calories as well. They just, they're so good with some sugar-free syrup and I'm really enjoying those, so I got that. I got another hot sauce. This one is lemon or something. It's like citrusy, so I got that, zero calories as well. I got some kosher dill pickles, zero calories. You see the trend here? I got a bundle of green onions, a bag of radishes, two bags of broccoli, three of asparagus, carrots, and that kale is for my bunny. And I went ahead and got a container of baby Bella mushrooms. And that is all that I bought today at Trader Joe's, sadly. I still have meat from Wild Fork last week, so we're probably gonna meal prep together this weekend at some point, but this is pretty much what I'm gonna be eating. 
in the coming days. Okay, so now that you saw the grocery haul, that's the stuff that's on my meal plan. That's what I'm gonna be eating this coming week. Um, Coach hasn't made any like really big changes to my diet in a while because we're still working, everything's still going really well. So right now I am just coming back from my mom's house. I went to the gym this morning. I did my cardio and my glute workout which was pretty killer but it got done today and um tomorrow i'll do my last stairmaster session and then i might hit a little bit of upper body but i might not i might not lift tomorrow um just to take the day off of lifting but if i do it's gonna be probably something like um a little bit of back or something just to touch on it but not much uh, I just came from my mom's like I said and she actually just pierced my ears I don't know if you guys have ever seen this and I don't recommend that you do it But my mom is the real one and she just opens these holes for me all the time So this one I got actually done at a tattoo shop years ago This one obviously when I was young, but then these two she did and then she just did She did the other two on the other side. I know they're not perfectly even but I don't really care I think they look pretty cool and I like like, you know, the aesthetic of it. So I've got that going on. Today, we are going to go and check out a place that we're potentially going to move to. So I'm really excited about that. And um, I had my breakfast and my first meal with my mom. I do pack my food on the weekends as well. So I'll show you guys what we get up to if my boyfriend gets anything to eat or you know what I'm eating later on, even though you already know it's the same stuff I've been eating so far. And I'm excited to bring you guys along for the next couple of days to show you everything that we get up to. Um, but for now, I'm just gonna chill here and wait for Javi to get off of work. Um, I'm gonna show you guys my outfit in a little bit because it looks pretty cool. I've got this cute little necklace that my mom just gave me now because I'm wearing this ring. And she's like, I have a necklace that matches. So isn't that funny? This is the ring. I got it from a store called Altered State. I don't know why it won't focus, but Altered State. I had never been to it and then my mom has this and then I've got this other little ring and this cute little bracelet with a little heart. Just adorable. So yeah, for now I'm gonna chill here. I think we're gonna go and get a coffee because on the weekends I'm not limiting my caffeine because I can sleep a little bit more. So it's okay if I don't fall asleep as early as normal. And yeah, that's all I got for you guys. I will catch you in a bit. What's up you guys happy Sunday I was dragging ass this morning and I look like it uh, just one of those days that I was extremely sore let me lower the AC okay I was extremely sore extremely tired I had no drive 
to get to the gym, but we did it. We did cardio, lift, and posing practice, and I feel really good about the posing, actually. Today, it felt really nice. Um, and now, we are going to go to Walmart because we are going to pick up some ground beef and chicken breast and look for some sugar-free sauces or something to spice things up. Um, I got a meal prep today for the coming week and I have enough veggies, I think, so I don't need any of that, but yeah, I need those things and that's pretty much it. Um, I'll take you guys along and I don't know what we're going to get into later. I would like to go to the beach or do some yoga or something like that. So we'll see, but I'll bring you guys along for the ride and, um, I'll see you in, in Walmart in just a second here. I'm so close to it cause I went to a different gym today. <laughs> There is nothing more satisfying than a well-stocked, well-organized fridge. We have all of our drinks and everything is just looking grade A in here. I love a clean fridge, guys. Is it just me? Good morning, you guys. Today is 4th of July, so happy 4th of July to everybody. I am so blessed. I feel so fortunate to live in a country where... I can choose my path in life and I have the freedom to express myself the way that I want to express myself and it's not perfect, you know, but no country really is. And if we look at the rights that we have and the liberties that we have here compared to other places in the world, I'm Cuban, so coming from a, a communist country or coming from a dictatorship, like when your family has struggled with famine, with food shortages, like I'm not talking about your favorite brand of, of chicken nuggets is not at the store right now. I'm talking about you got to go and make a line to get food for your family and then they tell you there's nothing. Those are the things that people here have never experienced, thank the Lord, and hopefully we never will. But it's amazing what we take for granted just because we have it in our face every single day, just because we, we have the liberty to speak about what we wanna speak. We can say anything that we want about anything here and it's it's free, you know? It's the land of the free and I just appreciate so much living here. My parents, my mom came here when I was really little to, to ensure a brighter future for me and my brothers and my sister and if she hadn't done that, I don't know where my life would be today. So honestly, God bless the USA. There's a lot of things that are imperfect but there's a lot of things that are amazing about this country that we live in so happy fourth of july happy birthday america not a long weekend for me i am working but it's okay because you know when you love what you do one of those things i'm on my way to some puppies now and um i had my oatmeal early this morning because i've been really really hungry guys for the past like two days um so I went ahead and ate my breakfast early and I don't know if that helped or not, but honestly, I just needed to eat it because I couldn't, I couldn't not. So we are driving now. I'm going to get home, pack up my food, get ready for the day, and then I'll catch you guys at my next meal or at the gym or we'll see what I get into. But I am excited for the day. Happy to see another Monday. 